we have uh, sixth question C here. A point capital P is 20 mm below HP, okay, and lies in third quadrant. Its shortest distance from from X Y reference line is going to be 40 mm. So draw its projections. So let us uh, check for the check the question, and uh, we shall draw it. So let us draw an XY reference line over here. So as per the question, what we have is so according to the question, point P is 20 mm below below HP. So below HP in the sense it can be anywhere over here, and he directly said it lies in the third quadrant. So point capital P lies in third quadrant. And below is 20 mm, and its shortest distance from x y line. So this is our x y reference line. So the distance from the point P is shortest distance from x y reference line is going to be. So this is the distance. The distance has been given as 40 mm. So this distance is 40 mm. Okay. So we don't know how much behind the point is. So here he didn't give how much behind. We gave we have the shortest distance and the below HP distance. So let us consider the shortest distance as x. Okay. So if I see the front view from this way and top view in this manner, I'm going to get front view over here. So it is going to be p dash and join this line, and this is going to be 20. And if I see the top view, it is going to be projector over here, small p, and this distance is going to be the opposite distance is x. Now we need to know this particular distance. So if we consider per this triangle, this triangle is going to be a, a right angle triangle. Okay. So according to the right angle triangle, we have Pythagoras theorem. So this is 40, this is 20 and this is x. So if we apply the Pythagoras theorem, we are going to get 40 square is equal to x square plus 20 square. Okay, so x is equal to, this is going to be 1600 and this is 400, move that side. So this is going to be root over 1200, that is 1600 minus 400. Okay, so root 1200 is nothing but 400 into 3. So root 400 is nothing but 20, root 3. So root 3 value is 1.732, so on. So approximately it is going to be 41 mm. So I took an approximate value. So we got the x value. Now we can draw the direct answer. So let us check. So on the vertical plane we have p dash. That is p dash is 20 mm below. This is p dash 20 mm below. And on rotating this particular part, this is going to move upwards. Okay, so that x mm distance is going to be 40 mm as we measure, as we found. So this is 41 mm. So this is how we need to find, guys. So let us see the.